Hey guys, Speedover20 here, back with another video today. I'm talking about the Roblox uh, classic avatars that have been leaked. Uh, before we switch, I just want to say, please join the Discord. Link will be in the description below. We're talking about Presents Day Sale 2020 on there. If you guys don't know what that is, just join the Discord and people will catch you up. It's a really good sale and there's potential for lots of profit for Luxos to decide to release limited during that sale. So anyways, let's start talking about this topic. And here we have the new Roblox, um, Roblox classic avatars that have been leaked now. These were leaked by some dude named Chris uh, 2726. I have the page pulled up here. Chris, uh, his thing's different. He's a different Twitter, Twitter handle. But basically, he had started uh, posting some of these um, screenshots of what appears to be these new packages here. And these things look extremely ugly. Let's just do a quick rundown of what we see here. Um, they got these, what appears to be two jointed um, pants. They got these little shoe cutouts. So again, uh, that's kind of brings me to the first problem, at least my problem with these things, is that they look like they're going to be ext extremely incompatible with Roblox clothes. Like, obviously, you guys know most, uh, you know, t-shirts and pants don't have cu specific cutouts for the, sh uh, the shoes, so it's going to look kind of weird here with this indentation because some shoes might be higher up and it just might be a mess. Uh, you got these two knee joints, as I just said here. You got what appears to be some weird, like, stretch weights. Like, look how warped that waist is. Again, this is kind of a render... From this dude, so it might not be how the final product looked. The final product might look a bit more polished, but that's just really weird. It's also stretched here, the new T-shirt mesh, uh, some bad shading there, stretched Roblox logo. Um, yeah, and you got this, uh, these shirt things, and you got these these uh, hands, I guess, which are gonna be really weird because most people, if you guys know uh, R6 shirts, usually have hands kind of cut out. Uh, at least like some, maybe sometimes they'll have some skin. Uh, cutouts on them and it's just not going to work out with these uh, additional hands these hands just like really weird like blocky um and they got these faces but i think that my biggest regret about these things is the head the head looks ridiculously stupid i mean they got this little stubby neck thing like uh, you know r6 doesn't have a neck they just have the head but they have these corkscrew heads it just looks terrible and these faces look super stretched out upon this it's just it's just overall it's disgusting <laughs> But, um, yeah, and then there was actually another leak, which has, I guess it was updated, and it has these new-looking avatars, so I guess I guess they're looking a bit different now. Still insanely weird. They still got the corkscrew heads with the little stubby necks. T-shirts are looking a bit better right now. Um, and, of course, the hair. These hairs were leaked on RBX leaks. Let's see the classic blocky f hair, male and female hairs, but um, yeah, he's got they got the uh they got the hairs on the faces, so it's looking a bit better here. Still really weird. I don't like the how it's like kind of pinched, and this person's like hips are like kind of swelled. It's a really strange at Roblox. I don't know what they're doing there, but um, yeah, I guess this is this is the updated render of the avatars, and here this brings me to this kind of link thing here that has um i guess this is yeah this is the renders of the two different avatars so i think you could probably this might be they might be uh using arthur scaling which allows you to basically scale one model and kind of dynamically change it so they might be have the scaling all the way up here and have it normal here that's why it looks i guess more classic and buff here and here it looks more skinny and stretched uh that kind of explains that but uh yeah overall this is in my opinion up and extremely ugly um ugly uh, avatar but if you guys know roblox is uh, they still do plan on or they're, st they're kind of updating the avatar system right now if you guys don't know they are let me go to it on the tweet here up here yeah they're actually adding a new avatar system here off this new sign up thing and supposedly it's out right now of course i tried doing this before this video but it didn't work so i don't think it's out but um i, I th supposedly the i don't know if these things are going to be free I mean, obviously, that's good if, it, if they're free, if it's more free items. But I think these things may even cost a bit of Robux because, uh, obviously, here's a, what appears to be a, a list of the free avatars coming in the new Roblox avatar update. They could obviously add more to this, but it's ranging from the, uh, I guess, the old classic avatars to the really weird and new Arthro. But it's looking like they're not, these leaked avatars are not going to be on this list here so at least until roblox might you know add these in an, in an update so that's really interesting but supposedly the system's out and they're not in there so 
yeah, I, I don't know. If these if Robux charges money for these things, that's ridiculous. These things look so ugly, and I don't think anyone will buy them. Uh, actually, well, they probably will get a lot of sales just because they look... They're, it's an excellent trolling outfit. They just look so stupid that people are just going to buy them up and troll with them. So, yeah. Anyways, that's all for this video. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Subscribe for more Roblox news and content. See you all, see you all later. Bye.